because we're up at a meeting in Tampa. Well, uh, Bradenton, Sarasota. We're going to be later on uh, at a roundtable discussion on uh, hurricane recovery and how churches can do that. But in the meantime, it's a pretty cool conference here at the... Uh, we're at Bayside Church. This was a church that really helped us after yeah. Irma. Yeah, they did. And, uh, they so they invited staff. us up for this. And it's uh, it's very cool. And they have really good worship. And why don't you just kind of show them, show them that way real quick. Kind of take that. You're going to have to go like, yeah, that. There we go. There we go. Okay. So, yeah, we're back. So we're not going to be there for the podcast. Douglas is going to do a few things. Uh, I also, I don't know, you can, maybe you can see my eye is kind of red. I I, have, I went to rub it yesterday and it had a subjunctal... Uh, Subconjunctal hemorrhage. Hematoma hemorrhage or something. Actually, it was had, scary. I, I went to uh, urgent care. And they, and it's okay. And, and there's nothing you can do for it. So uh, other than it gets better over time. But it looks, I could do this. It looks really then, bad. And it was very scary, and yes, I made him go to urgent yeah, care. We talked about putting a patch on it, but then I, mean, I looked like a pirate, so I'm not okay. doing it. okay. You could be a pirate so, uh, so anyway, we miss you guys, and I think Doug's going to maybe show you around the facility, the new, you know, the, some of the change we're making. But uh, that's it from us, and uh, we yeah. love you guys. We miss you. We'll be back uh, Thursday evening, so um, that, that'll be great. Yeah. And uh, that's all from us. Love you guys. Love you. See you Bye-bye. soon. Bye-bye. Hey guys, it's Doug here. Um, my parents are out of town in Tampa. They went to a conference. It's the Relate Conference at the Bayside Community Church. Uh, if you were here around Irma, you might remember Bayside. Uh, they helped us out quite a bit. They, um, they would actually send down one of their staff members or a, a volunteer, sometimes it was a couple too, and they would send one down and uh, they did this for six weeks. The, the volunteer staff member would uh, take over the disaster operations here at the church. So uh, for a season, it was my dad just working seven days a week, you know, nonstop, no breaks. So uh, the, this member would take over the operations for him. So he was able to rest for a period and, and you know, get back to his normal life. So they were a big help. And, and you know, they've been a big help. They sent huge waves of volunteers for uh, recovery and stuff. So. Uh, they're an amazing church. They're actually gearing up to uh, start another wave of help down here. They want to figure out how they can help. So my parents are there uh, discussing with them different strategies for that. Uh, so anyway, I thought I would take this time and do a little vlog style thing, showing you guys some of the uh, improvements and changes we're doing. I'll uh, talk to my father-in-law and Doug Lepps. They've been a big part of it. Um, you'll notice some of the changes. I'm just kind of going around uh, the building, we've painted it. We've also uh, painted the ceiling black, so that's good. We've added a couple new screens. I'm just trying to give you guys a perspective here. Uh, we're, you know, this is Tuesday now when I'm recording it. Uh, we're painting this burgundy. That's obviously been painted gray. Uh, we're installing some new uh, mood lighting up there as well. Uh, so we're going to have uh, the ability to light the crowd, which is kind of a cool concept. So, you know, when the stage lights are going and let's say it's, you know, red on there, I could make them red on the ceiling. So we're all red together. And, you know, that could be a good color or an angry color. Who knows? Uh, it could be blue, purple, whatever we want. We'll have that flexibility. You'll also notice uh, back here, we've got these uh, panels here. These are actually acoustic panels. They're gonna help the sound in the room. If you're watching online, probably doesn't impact you a whole lot, but if you're in the room, uh, you will notice a bit of a difference. You can actually come in here and clap, and like I can almost see the sound bouncing off the walls. <laughs> you can't really see sounds, but I, you know, musician brain here. So that helps with the sound there. Uh, we're, we're gearing up to install some LED strips along the walls, and we've got the, the maintenance crew here. My father-in-law does not like being on camera, so here he is on camera in this Courage 2 shirt. There's Chaplain Doug. Hi everyone. What are we working on right now? LED walls. LED wall, well, walls that are being, you know. They're gonna be lit by the LED, LED strips. Cause we have walls that are literally LED walls. These are LED These strips are LED going strips. on the walls. Yeah, this will be cool. Uh, you know, I'm thinking like movie night effect. It'll be blue. It's gonna be very cool when it's done. Very cool. Tom, you got any thoughts on the renovation as you walk away? Well, Doug, I'm gonna hold you to it. You're only as good as your last call. We just talked about that earlier. So I think I think you're onto something here though. 
And uh, this weekend for worship, I'll give you a little update on that. We got Billy and Angie with us. I believe we're starting with the song Battle Belongs by Phil Wickham. That'll be a good one. And then uh, Miss Alicia is joining us. She's doing a new one from the Anaheim Vineyard called Greater Things. Uh, it's on their new record that just came out. You can check that out. Uh, after that, let's see who's doing it. Angie's doing a song. It's uh, Prophesy Your Promise by the uh, Brian and Katie Torwalt. That'll be good. And then uh, I'm actually going to introduce an arrangement of I Surrender All that was pretty good that I heard. And then uh, my wife is ending with the song. I'm trying to remember what it is. It's in C, key of C. What does she do in the key of C that ends it? What are we doing? If I had an app, I could load up Planning Center, but I don't have it right now. I go upstairs and find out because I have it in Pro Presenter. So you can just follow me. There's there's Fran. Fran, how you doing? I'm doing very good. We're doing a vlog style podcast for tomorrow night. So it's not live, but it's recorded. I might even edit out the part where I didn't know the song and just, and, you know, we don't really edit stuff. We just kind of go with the flow. Taking up the stairs. You can see it from here. It's pretty cool. We have this room we've been working on. This is uh, like a little staff room. You're part of the crew. I'm actually part of a Zoom workshop tomorrow. So I have, a, I have a little station in here set up. Oh, I have to turn the computer on, man. I was not prepared. I just was like, oh, let's turn the phone on and go. Uh, this is the little tech room here, in case you didn't know. Everything's off right now. You can see down there. I will know in a second. Okay, so turn on the computer. It's a vineyard song. You have set me free. Should have thought of that. That's pro presenter. That's what we run all the lyrics with. It's a big part of my life. I have to use it like every day. I don't have much of a life, apparently. <laughs> yeah, so just, just a quick little show you guys what we're doing. Nothing too specific. Um, hope you're doing well. I miss being a part of the podcast with Dad. We've been, you know, renovating this a few more weeks. And then uh, I will be joining you more frequently on Wednesdays. Hope to be getting back to that. Uh, Vine Press is what we normally do. Dad answers those questions. Keep submitting them. Uh, get ready. If you're part of the Institute, uh, you know, I'm proud of you guys. You're doing great. Always have great questions. Uh, you know, my dad sends his love. Obviously, you'll see him this weekend. So... Uh, it was great spending this few minutes with you. You get a nice shot of my face there, a little too close. Uh, <laughs> see you soon.